Hello everyone, Inventor719 here, and recently I showed you guys a video of this modified Nintendo Game Boy that I made and asked if you wanted to see my other inventions, and I got a lot of people that said yes. And so, just before I get started here, I'm going to say that um, a lot of them are just like this invention. I didn't build them to be perfect or the greatest thing in the world or the next best invention. I just built them for fun and I thought they were kind of cool and I was trying to be creative with what I had around the house. Did not spend much money on any of these projects and there's lots of prototypes in here. So I'm going to open the bag and show you what they are. Just remember that so you don't um, think it relates to any of my new projects or like my building capabilities or whatever. These are strictly just for fun projects I built probably between the ages of 10 and 13. Let's see what they are. So here's what was inside the bag. Not all the products I've built when I was little, but quite a few, uh, to say the least. So I'll go through them quickly and show you what they are. So this was a prototype of a cardboard boat I made for a grade 8 school project where we built a full-size model that looked just like this, called, the, called it the Bermuda Triangle. Um, it was probably five times like scale right here. And it held 800 pounds and we actually paddled it across a swimming pool there and back, so fun little project. Um, next up, one of my practical inventions. Uh-oh, falling apart. It's just a toothbrush, that's supposed to be on there. It's like an automatic feeding toothbrush kind of jig. Let me show you what it's supposed to look like. Just like that. And basically you put your toothpaste in here and plunge it forward. It would go up the tube and I drilled a hole through the bristles here. So it's like a self toothpaste feeding toothbrush kind of thing. And if this was bigger, it'd be great for travel or whatever you'd like. I thought that was a great idea when I was little. Here we have a fork with a light on it for eating in the dark or camping or something. Hooks straight up to a battery, which is dead right now, but that light used to light up real nice. Little silverware holders. I even made my own little pretend packaging, which is kind of funny. So basically I think the idea of these when I made them were to set them down on the table for something to rest your silverware on. So this one's for a spoon and these are for knives and forks. So you're not setting them right on the tablecloth, so you or your mom don't have to wash the dish, the tablecloth as much. This is a little multi-tool I made with a magnifying glass and some tweezers. And I think when I made this, the idea was for stamp collecting, because these are the two tools that stamp collectors use. So there's that. I made a little wooden gun prototype with a plunger. As you can see, it's still in pro progress. And there's supposed to be a trigger assembly here which goes through that drilled hole to latch on to a notch in the bottom of this. Oh, it's in the top right now, but if it was spun upside down, it would hang onto the notch and stuff. So I might finish this and make a video of it, actually. But as you can see, that's the idea. Simple, but, but cool. Little metal barrel. Yep, very simple. I think I tried to make an electric toothbrush here, as you can see. 9 volt hooks straight up to a little motor in here and used to have a little toothbrush head on it. I didn't actually use it because obviously there's probably a high chance it'll get shocked but I still built it just for fun. Two more things here. A um, little practical invention I thought was cool. It was a little pencil lead protector put on over top of your pencil when traveling or some whatever and if you drop it the lead will be fine. It won't break or anything. Kind of cool. And lastly I made a copper pipe flute and you blow on this end here, and I actually measured the distances. If any of you guys take physics with the wavelengths to make different frequencies, which are actually different notes, so we got A, G, F, and E. And yeah, simple, but actually works. Uh, I won't play right now, but you can believe me. Anyway, there's all the little inventions I made when I was little. Let me know which one's your favorite one and uh, what you think about them because it was a pretty high requested video, I guess. So thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video, and as always, please like, comment, and subscribe. And stay tuned for my next video, which is the 50,000 subscriber giveaway. Thanks for watching.